She stood on the balcony and inexplicably hiccuping and amicably welcoming them in. One more time. She stood on the balcony inexplicably inexplicably hiccuping and amicably welcoming them in. One more time. She stood on the balcony inexplicably hiccuping and amicably welcoming them in. Hi, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> We're back doing some taste tests. It's Robert and... Jim Suriani. Hello. Hello. So, we're feeling very optimal today. We have orange and black. Very Halloween-y. And I have a surprise for you. <gasps> you do? A surprise? You were not here for the last taping of oh. these, so I <gasps> saved you something. Uh -oh. Everybody remembers these. Oh. Uh... And I even mentioned you by name, so I thought maybe you'd like to give these a try. <laughs> Are you okay. scared? I'm a little scared because I don't know if I've... Because you watched the video, didn't you? Well, and I've heard. <laughs> there are three left. For you. Well, <laughs> it can't be that bad. No, these are the um, pumpkin spice salted caramels. Right. I just want your reaction, just real quick while we're here. Okay, see what happens. No, as you can salted. see, there's still some available. <laughs> <laughs> now, I do like salt and I do like caramel. So. so, just to remind you, this is the Trader Joe's dark chocolate pumpkin spice salted caramels. Okay. That's almost as good as yours. Wow, let me see. Want another one? Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, keep going. Oh my keep God. it going. Keep oh it going. Mm. Mm. I thought you'd be into this as it's nice and salty. I love salt. I love chocolate. Oh my, oh my God, I'm going to gag. <laughs> oh God, this is gross. Oh. Why are my eyes are watering? I hope they bring them back for. There's now. <laughs> I hope they bring them back next year. Oh my God, those are so terrible. Okay, so let's get on uh, with the show. Wow. Well, I, have I some, need a drink now. I have something to cure that. Here, you can hold that one and I'll hold oh, this yay. one. So today Ooh. we oh, have, we, this, the theme of this is, <laughs> you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. The theme of today is apples, juice, <laughs> and alcohols. Wow, what a combo. Apple juice and alcohol. Well, you know, actually, spiced cider goes really well with Mm. Oh, I bet. Stuff. So, um, just to introduce here, so I've got JP, JP Whispers Spiced Whiskey Vanilla, perfect for the frat girl or the frat boy in you. Can and I what please, do you have? Can I please tell you that chocolate is still... It's okay. The sooner you get to the alcohol, the sooner you can yeah, wash no. it down. Yeah, no, I need to wash it down with the alcohol because, wow, I need to burn that sh stuff off. Um, this is a... I say Cuervo. This is Cuervo. And the, what is this word here? Gin... Sinje. 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 As in, cinnamon. Know, is, as in cinnamon. Is Sinje? Is that cinnamon? I'm Spanish. not sure, but it's a, it's a, it has a scorpion. It, so is this te tequila? Is this tequila? I believe it's tequila. Yeah, Jose, oh, yeah. it's tequila, tequila with with cinnamon. So with and cinnamon. then um, of cinnamon. course, mom, mom. Mom. we have um, Trader Joe's spice cider, which you could actually mix with these. Word. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So, um, so why don't we do this? Why don't we start with some cider? Okay. And we have a glass with some ass, and you have a glass with some ass. We could we could start with some. Or do we want to use these glasses for the cider? It's okay. We got we got a big bowl. Of ice. Right, we do we do have a big bowl. Of we ice. have a giant bowl of ice because we have lots to drink here. So. Lots of drinking to do on a Tuesday, no less. Oh, it's know. Tuesday. <laughs> it's after five o'clock, so I'll give you I'll give you a big. Big cup big of glass. juice, because I have a feeling you're going to need it. Yes, you I can do. Walk, right, quick, get, quick, quick, get that out of your mouth. Mm. <laughs> Alright, I'll give it a taste to you. Let's just smell Get it. that out of your mouth. Oh, that smells nice. Oh, it does smell nice. Mmm. Mmm. That's really good. Mm-hmm. You like it? I, I do, I like it. Is it better than the... Yeah, it's um, better than the salted is chocolate. Is it better than this? Oh, yes. <laughs> Trader Joe's, I love you, but you need to limit... I mean, you have a lot of pumpkin products, and we'll probably get to that sometime, but... The caramels are just, they got to go. You want to know what's in this? Uh-huh. Unfiltered juice from ripe whole apples, lemon juice, concentrate, spices, oh. allspice, cinnamon, and cloves, water, orange peel, lemon peel, and orange oil. Oh. So, no crap. No crap. Yeah, no crap. Yeah, 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 yeah. no crap. No crap. Real stuff. So, um... And I think it tastes pretty good. It tastes I spicy, so but it doesn't taste overly spicy. It's not, and it's, it's got a very different taste than what you normally would have with cider. It's like a whole mouth. It's really good. Very different. I give it like an eight or a nine. That's yeah, I, I would too. Um, this is so perfect. The only thing that make this better is whipped cream and warmth. Oh, yeah. Heat it up. Oh, for Oh, Christmas by the way, parties. somebody told me online, oh. and I tried it last night, 
Starbucks makes hot apple cider with caramel sauce and whipped Ooh. cream and spices. Spices. And I had it last night. And apparently it's available all year. Oh, not just not just during the season. Right. Oh, that's nice to know. So if you like a hot, hot apple cider, you know. Okay. Let's get to getting. Let's get to the alcohol. Okay. So why don't we pull, why don't we start with this one? Do you care? Which one? Um, no, I don't care which one. So we have this one. Let me see your. Let me see yours. This is the tequila. We have these two, and as a control, just because we know from the past, because as you can see, there's a little bit drank. There's um, a little bit. We of have fun. Fireball here, so I brought this in just as a control because everybody knows what Fireball tastes like. Yes. So um, why don't I pour some Fireball, and we can we can refresh ourselves refresh, on what that refresh is. Refresh our memory on what Fireball tastes like. <laughs> or go back to Robert's and then we'll party have a last year. <laughs> At my party, there was a punishment, and if you screwed up, you had to drink Fireball. Uh-huh. Fireball? Fireball. Ching -ching. Cheers. All right, so just to remember. Gin Don Uno. It tastes like cinnamon. Yeah, yeah it, it really does. It tastes like liquid cinnamon. It tastes cinnamon. like what you would think um, cinnamon extract would taste yeah. like. Yeah. Yeah. It's good. With a, with okay, a little so bit more burn, but yeah. This is a control. All right, mm. well, as long as we're on cinnamon, so we just go down the cinnamon room here. Woo! Let's see how... How you doing, Jim? How we doing? Okay, so just to re review, this is the Jose Cuervo Singe, C-I-N-G-E. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but that would be the English oh, pronunciation. Uh, Jose Cuervo Especial Cinnamon Tequila Infused with Cinnamon and Natural Flavors. Um, I think this was like nine bucks. It was super cheap, which is why I bought it, because I was feeling cheap that day. Um, it says sharp and fiery and mild flavors. A shot of Jose Cuervo is specially meant to scorch the fire sting of the Mexican scorpion. Oh, wow. Es scorpion. Es scorpiano. The most <laughs> popular brand of tequila, Jose Cuervo. Mm. From Lynchburg, Indiana. Oh, wait. somebody loves us. <laughs> Yay. Okay, so I could crack in this open. Do you want to smile? Sure. What does this, does it singe you? Can you smell it at it all? It smells like tequila. <laughs> Go yes. figure. It smells like tequila. <laughs> I don't really smell cinnamon. I'll pour us little shots. Yes, let's do little shots. We have a lot to get through with this video. We're doing a lot of videos tonight. <laughs> so so it's clear. Ones. There's not really anything to see. Smell. Mm, yeah. It totally smells like tequila. It smells like tequila. I don't smell cinnamon at I all. I smell like lime with tequila. Yeah, yeah. Maybe yeah. that's the smell. A little bit of the lime. Alright, ready? Ready. Cheers. Cheers. It's definitely singy. It's singy, yeah. You know, I it, like that. That's nice. It's like, boom, hot, yeah. and then gone. Yeah. It's like, boom, gone. It's not like the fireball, that, which we're using as comparison. The fireball, it just, I can still taste the fireball. By fireball, it like goes in and it, it smells and tastes like you ate a Christmas pine cone with cinnamon flavor. Yeah, that's exactly right. This. This is very subtle. But it's very. This has the burn of tequila that comes real quick. Mm-hmm. But then it's gone. Yeah, but it's very fast and there's just a. A hint of the cinnamon, and then you kind of get that bitter, that bitterness that you have with tequila. Right, right. Which isn't bad, but the, it's just tequila. But so many times, though, if you take shots of tequila, you're like, "Where's the lime? Where's the lime?" <laughs> well, no, that's good. You know what? I'm gonna try it with just a little wash down. Now we have, that's we have really cola good. here as well. If you'd like to have cola as a mixer, this would make a great holiday. You know what? I totally drink. watch this. See this. I'm making, oh, a, I'm, making I'm making a cocktail a Robert, on air. Robert cocktail special. I'll just make one and you can try mine. How's that? There Unless we go. you want. Well, let's try it together. Why right. not? Oh, I need a part of it. Oh. There's your holiday cocktail. There's the holiday cocktail. There's what you're drinking on Halloween when you're walking the kids around the neighborhood. <laughs> yes, in your flask. Go ahead, kids. Go up to the scary house with their lights on. I just want this be in with the car. this and a straw. Mm-hmm. What do you think? Oh, I like that. That that's, would make a great... That's dangerous. That is dangerous because it tastes very fruity hashtag, and... Hashtag dangerous. Be careful, cocktail. Okay, that's, that's, yeah. that's good. That's something to have before you... To, yeah, before you take the kids walking on Halloween night. <laughs> or maybe not. I don't know. I don't want to... <laughs> I, was, I got to stumble on Halloween night with the kids. Go ahead, kids. Or if you're not going with kids, you know, put on your toga outfit and go to whatever party, fantastical that's party you're going That's right. You know, whatever slut outfit you or have. Or your slut outfit or your witchy poo outfit or whatever. Because, you know, Halloween is all about wearing your slut outfit. That's right. And as tiny as it can possibly be, no matter whether you're 
a big boy like us, or if you're tiny or whatever. Everyone no, wears no tiny. No tiny costume. No tiny. Okay, so this is J.P. Whispers Spiced Whiskey Vanilla Canadian Whiskey with natural flavors, natural flavor and caramel color. 86 proof as opposed to, what was the proof on this? Did we didn't see that? This is only 70 proof. So this is 40% 40, 40 alcohol. This has got more alcohols in it. Alcohol. Hashtag warning, I am not a whiskey fan. And you know that. Yeah. But you may not know that. I am not a whiskey fan. I had a bad experience when I was a youngster with brown liquor. <laughs> with brown. The brown liquor. Liquor, I hardly know her. J.P. Weiser earned the nickname the River Baron, boldly controlling the spice route along the spice route along the St. Lawrence River. Did you know that was a spice route? I had route? no idea. On the St. Lawrence River, known as the pioneer whiskey maker, he experimented with blending whiskey and exotic spices, especially for Halloween. <laughs> Why do I hear banjo music in my head right in now? A secret <laughs> chamber within the distillery. These recipes were recently dis uncovered by J.P. Weiser's private archives. Today, JP's number five is your is yours to discover. Hmm. Oh, okay, so it does say number five. So I would have never read that. So it does say number five. I just didn't really know that was part of the name. So this is JP with with Weiser. Oh, Weiser. Weiser's. JP Weiser. Weiser's. If I can pronounce oh, it right. Oh, okay. Um, cheers. Cheers. This so is this JP is Weiser. Canadian whiskey, spiced whiskey with vanilla, with caramel color and vanilla. Huh. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Um, uh, <laughs> cheers. Cheers. <laughs> great knowing you. <laughs> okay, I'm only tasting a tiny bit of this. You know what it tastes like? Hmm. Cheap ass whiskey with vanilla. <laughs> yeah, it does it, it taste cheap. I'm like, hmm. You like that? I don't know. It's alright. It's, it's great. It just kind of tastes like. Um, what do they call it at a bar when you when you like well like the, well it the tastes well like it whiskey. tastes like well whiskey house whiskey or whatever but you know what might make it better more apple juice more <laughs> apple juice <laughs> let's try you want to try it with apple juice Shoot, let me try it with apple juice oh yeah much better <laughs> <laughs> is it better okay. way better you can hardly taste it at all mm. That's the Halloween punch I don't want to drink. <laughs> yeah, I know. I don't think I need to. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. Let's Ooh. rate this. So, what'd you give this? I would give that a, I think nine. Is that the that's the a nine? Uh, really? That high? I think so. Okay. I would probably give this like a seven or eight. I think it's good. Mm -hmm. I'm just not a huge tequila You're fan. You're not a tequila fan. Um, yeah. and it feels a little gimmicky. Like, yeah. Hey guys, For the holidays. guess what we've got? Yeah. Um, it's okay. I, I think. You know what? Maybe I give it an eight or a nine because it comes on fast. It's good, and then it's gone. I, th I think for holidays, for you know Halloween, and especially and as a mixer, and, as a mixer, yeah, um, definitely as a mixer, and um, for you know a special cocktail during the holidays. That one, oh god, I think below a five, def below five. Yeah, I'm like five. Yeah. I'm like four. Maybe if you like whiskey, or maybe if you need to maybe beef if you up your cola, your spice <laughs> punch at Christmas time. Well, yeah, when you're all out of the the jack. <laughs> you know what? This would be good in. This would be good in eggnog. Oh yeah. Because the go. eggnog would be nice and sweet, and this would have vanilla overtones. Oh, this and eggnog, say. I think that would not be bad. Yeah. So, but still, like a five. <clears throat> I'm like like a five. Yeah, okay. definitely mixing it with something else, but not uh, with your cola or whatever. Oh, I like the spice uh, cider. I would say. That's eight or nine. Yeah, I would give this a nine. I think this yeah. is a really good product. Um, a nine because it's not perfect, but um, perfect would be fresh. But, yeah, I think. I but think. other than that, I think this is really good. And again, for the holidays, you can do a <laughs> lot with that. Well, look what we did already. <laughs> we're already having a holidays. We're having happy holidays, right. early October. Funny, final ching ching. Ching ching. Ching ching. Happy holidays. Jinan. Thanks, you guys, for watching. Um, we're going to continue to drink this and taste other things. And drink ourselves under the table. <laughs> if you'd like to find Jim's channel, it's... Mr. Jim Suriani, S-I-R-I-A-N-N-I. -N -N um, on, on YouTube. On the tube of the U. And I'm Robert Jones. You can find me as Eudemonius, E-U-D-A-E-M-O-N-I-U-S. Or this channel on Facebook, Eudemonius Mark II, M-A-R-K-I-I. If you guys would like to find out more about this product selection, you can check my blog at eudemoniusmark2.blogspot.com written right here. Right here. So, Alright you guys, have a good one and we'll see you on the next video. Bye. Bye.